I want to demonstrate how the free target PC client is supposed to work. In the previous video, I talked about all the features of the software, but uh, there is no indication on how it's supposed to do the actual usage. So the idea is you first set up the software explained in the other video is how you configure the application and you create the events and select the events that you actually use and the target that is actually configured so this assumes that you have done all of that then at the range you connect to the target and the first event already starts the event that you specify here the default event usually it's supposed to be practice practice is defined by the uh, triangle in the top right of the target so either you have a normal practice and uh, maybe you increase the zoom and uh, you just shoot or for a competition simulation or an actual competition, this is used as sighters. Once the sighters are completed, you just switch to the new event, pistol match or rifle match. The other uh, session is ended and the new session is started for the match. So it's one hour and 15 minutes, the counter starts ticking down. So this is intended to run with as few clicks as possible on the on the laptop that you are using at the range so just click connect and start shooting and if you want to switch to to match just click once here in the pistol match and then if you want to switch to final just click here into the final so this is just how it's intended to work without uh, too much clicks and without uh, any other disconnections or other uh, interventions in the PC client. In addition to the normal usage of the target, I want to introduce two new features that uh, have been implemented since the last video was done. That video was on version 3.3.0 now the PC software is in version 4.9.2. So the first uh, feature that I want to show and explain how it's working is the resume session. So let's say you have started shooting and you have a few shots on target and then something happens to the connection to the target my target sometimes drops the the usb connection or the usb cable has a problem or the wi-fi has a hiccup and the connection to the target is lost usually this means that you take a shot and nothing registers on the software on the screen no shot and then it's stuck because in order to reconnect the software to the target you need to disconnect and reconnect and that disconnection usually ends the session so let's say you took a shot and nothing happened you click disconnect this happen uh, this uh, save session warning appears you say yes and then you unplug and replug the usb cable or you reconnect the wi-fi whatever and then you click connect again and the software starts a new session but you have this button resume session and you select these are all the previous sessions that are in this uh, for this event you select usually the last session click ok and the last session is uh, resumed including the time so if it's a match it will just resume from i mean the the time will be the same you lose a few seconds from from the 
time you disconnect it, replug the cable and so on, but the time, the start time of the session is the same, so it counts from when you started the original session. And the other feature that I want to show you is the automatic recovery. Let's say you are shooting, you shot uh, 15 shots and the laptop crashes, Windows crashes. The software, something happens, it freezes up, you need to restart the computer or you need to kill the, the software and start it again. And if that happens, I killed it now from the debug. When you start the software again, it will show this window saying that it detected uh, abnormal shutdown so that the last session was not saved and was not disconnected properly. This is done from the file log. And you have the option to either uh, continue the session or no. You click yes, but it says here, recovery will happen after the PC client connects to the target. So you click yes, it will start normally. You click connect and the session is recovered from the log. It will have uh, the same timestamp and all the, the shots that were previously shot and you can continue from there. So this is a protection in case something happens to the software so that the shots are not lost, you can recover it. It happened to me a few times that the battery of the laptop died while shooting so I had to plug it in and uh, so this will help me not to lose all my shots because the session uh, is saved only at the end when you click disconnect or when you switch to another session. So you can continue to shoot until you finish your session and then save it. I usually save it by switching to a new event you see here session saved, also here, and then it's saved to disconnect.